That's the Schumann resonance, but it's also being affected by the sun because everything's connected. And it's also been said that the resonance, there's like a heartbeat, like a frequency, yeah. right? Of yeah. the earth. Yeah. Is it, yeah. Can you like expand on that or is that changed yeah. or like? It is changing. So in general, the Schumann resonance refers to a set of measurements that are tra tracking the spectrum peaks in the extremely low frequency portion of the Earth's electromagnetic field spectrum, the ELF, right? I love how creative they were with the names, just side effect, extremely low, ultra low. Okay. Um, <laughs> How much did you pay for that? Anyway, um, so this is the measurement. It was discovered in 1952 by Dr. Schumann. That's why it's called the Schumann Resonance, um, but it's a collection of measurements. Lightning discharges within the cavity will also fuel this. Sneeze, tectonic plate movements, all of these things will resonate. It's kind of like imagine a, a cushion of air around the earth. Energy gets in there and sort of ping pongs around, and that's what we're measuring. The base frequency of the earth is 7.83 hertz. But it has subsequent harmonic frequencies at 14.3, 20.8, 27.3, and 33. Right? Some great numbers in there. The 7.83 for, I don't know, 50 years of observing it has been pretty steady. It's no longer steady. It's jumping way up into the 8, like 8.01, 8.12. I've seen it as high as 8.23, which is huge compared to where it was. What that means is that the frequency, the contractions in the heart are getting closer and closer together. The heartbeat is speeding up and gaining power. So when you look at the graph, at the Tomsk graph, there are several that you're given. One looks like a actual heartbeat graph. If you can go back over the last, I'd say, two years, you can clearly see them getting taller and closer together, more and more and more. And I've had a lot of people liken it to when someone's in labor and they have a thing on your belly and they're monitoring during your contractions, that's very much what it looks like. These contractions are getting closer and closer and higher and stronger. And I, I, again, don't think that's any coincidence with everything that's going on right now. It just feels like Mother Earth is like ready to have this baby, like get it out. And you know, we're all here for the ride. 